Hey, what's up guys? Olong here, coming at you with uh, a man eater little tip. So we're going to try to get this license plate. Uh, we're out here in Dead Horse Lake. Uh, I'm not sure if this license plate has a name, um, but it's the one right outside the grotto. It's pretty high up. Right now we're a level 26 adult. We've cleared like the first three areas and are like halfway through Sapphire Bay. Uh, have full bioelectric with exception of the head. Um, the one thing that might matter about having the bioelectric set would be uh, we can use the active ability from the bioelectric body to uh, move faster. Um, so we might use that to help us get uh, up in the air a bit higher. But the main thing I kind of wanted to talk about here and then I had just discovered, this might be obvious to a lot of people already, but uh, you actually have your shark's movement in the air is not... It's, in, it's completely in your control, right? So if I'm up in the air, like obviously jumping, it'll send your shark in the direction of his nose, right? And you can actually control which way your shark's nose is pointing while you're in the air. Um, it's a little bit counterintuitive because normally in like air-based stuff in games, you would feel like when you pull back on the camera, right? If you were to say, uh, you know, if you're flying a plane, right? And you wanted your plane to go up, you would kind of pull down in order to get your nose to go up and vice versa for getting the nose to go down you would put you would move the camera uh, you would like push forward it's the reverse of that right so if you if you want your shark's nose to go up you have to move the mouse up if you want your shark's nose to go down you have to move the mouse down it's just like uh, your camera controls but you're you know moving your shark like that in midair so you can use this to direct which way you're jumping right so if i'm up in middle air and i need to lunge forward a lot then i want to flatten out my shark and get him to move forward right if i want to go high then i want him to point his nose in the air to get him to go air and so how i've been using this actually is to help like traverse land a bit easier so basically you can use your first jump to get your shark high in the air by pointing the nose up and then you can traverse more ver uh, horizontally with the second jump or you can kind of just do a 45 degree angle right but anyway so basically this is all just to say hey you can control your shark completely in the air, and then he'll his extra jumps will go in the direction of his nose. So using this, we're going to try to use that to get up to that license plate, which actually, after doing that just there, I feel like is totally reasonable as an adult. Oh, yeah. And if we don't get it, then we'll go and try to use the bioelectric body active ability. All right. There we go. Well, cool. Anyway, so I don't know how obvious this was to everyone, but I had just kind of figured it out and I thought it was pretty cool. So, um, anyway, there you go. I uh, hope this was maybe helpful and hope you enjoy playing the game as much as I am. So, have a good one and we'll catch you later.